एवरीवन वेलकम टू इंटेलिपैथ्स यूट्यूब चैनल इन टुडे सेशन वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट डेटा आर्किटेक्ट सैलरी सो बिफोर वी मूव ऑन विद अ लाइव सेशन प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू आवर चैनल एंड आल्सो इफ यू वांट अपकमिंग अपडेट्स प्लीज हिट द बेल आइकन एंड आल्सो लीव अ लाइक इफ यू एंजॉय आवर कंटेंट बिफोर गेटिंग स्टार्टेड लेट्स गो विद द एजेंडा फॉर टुडे फर्स्ट वी लर्न हु अ डेटा आर्किटेक्ट इज देन वी विल डिस्कस द एवरेज सैलरी दैट अ डेटा आर्किटेक्ट इन इंडिया अर्न्स After that we will understand the factors that affect the salary of a data architect next we learn about the future prospects for someone who chooses this profession and finally we will discuss how you can begin learning and get started so let's begin and see who a data architect is data architects are the brains behind data architecture a data architect is a professional who designs creates and manages an organization's data architecture they translate business requirements and give technical requirements data architects define how data is stored integrated and used within the organization the main job of a data architect is to study business requirements and create technology road maps to meet those requirements they also design blueprints for the flow of data and ensure that data is available to the people who need it data architects are very important for an organization let's see how much they are paid in india for the role that they have as per the data available on talent.com the average salary of a data architect in india is around 22 lakhs per annum the salaries can range from 15 lakhs per annum for an entry level position to 38 lakhs per annum for experienced and seasoned professionals The average salary is very high compared to the average salary for a software developer which is around 5 lakhs per annum which is the career most chosen by computer science graduates now that we've seen what the average salary of a data architect in india is let's see what factors can affect their incomes now that we've seen what the average salary of a data architect in india is let's see the factors that affect their incomes first factor is job location as a data architect or any other professional your salary will highly depend on the job location where you're working salaries offered in metropolitan cities like delhi and mumbai or it hubs like bangalore pune and hyderabad are usually higher than those in smaller cities these cities provide companies with the infrastructure that they need to survive but along with the higher salaries living expenses in metropolitans are also higher looking at the salaries that data architects earn on an average in the major indian cities living in delhi as a data architect you can earn around 24 lakhs 56000 annually which is above the nas- national average whereas in mumbai the average income comes down to 15 lakhs per annum in bangalore which is known as the it city of india data architects earn around 19 lakhs 17000 annually on an average in hyderabad the average salary is 17 lakhs 22000 per annum and in pune and chennai the salaries are 17 lakhs 82000 and 16 lakhs 58000 per year respectively coming to industry coming to industry experience your experience with designing and handling database management systems is also an important factor that employers consider while deciding your salary companies seek experienced and hard working professionals who can use data to maximize profits work experience will have the biggest impact on your pay scale let's understand how much according to payscale.com in an entry level position a data architect with around 1 to 4 years of work experience in the it industry earns around 8 lakh 80000 annually on an average on the other hand highly experienced professionals working as data architects for around for around 10 to 15 years on more than 20 lakh per annum the average salary for data architects with 5 to 9 years of experience is 14 lakh 96000 it is very clear that as you gain experience in the industry your value as a data architect will increase and so will the amount on your paycheck employer or company The bigger the size of the company, the more salary you can expect. Tech giants like IBM, Oracle, Infosys, Adobe, TCS, and Amazon have humongous amount of data. To utilize this data, they need skilled and experienced data architects, and they are willing to pay high salaries for that. 
According to the data on Glassdoor.com, the big data architect salary in India offered by Deloitte on an average is 28,61,000 per annum and that offered by Cognizant Technology Solutions is 20,50,000. The average salaries that companies like Tata Consultancy Services, Accenture, IBM and Fiserv pay to their employees are 14,83,000, 16,16,000, 18,76,000, 18,76,000 and 10,80,000 per annum respectively. Coming to the skills, a data architect salary in India is also impacted by the skills that they have. Being a data architect requires expertise in skills like data modeling, database architecture, database management and programming languages like Python, Java and C++. According to the data on payscale.com, people with skills like AWS, ETL, data management and big data analytics earn around 19%, 10%, 9% and 7% more than the average data architect in India. Skills like data modeling, data warehousing, Python and Hadoop are also correlated with salaries that are above average. Data architects with an expertise in data modeling earn 19,86,529 rupees per annum on an average. The average annual income of professionals with skills like database architecture, business intelligence, data warehouse and big data analytics are 19,67,000, 19,17,000, 20,10,000 and 21,17,000 respectively. Gender. Like almost all other industries in the world, gender pay gap exists in the IT industry too. According to sixfigure.com, for the same skills and equal work, if a man earns 100 rupees, a woman earns only 89. It is a huge cause of concern that men and women with the same skill set and work experience still earn different amounts of money just because of their gender. Quite evidently, becoming a data architect in India these days is very rewarding. So let's see what the future holds for them. This job requires a lot of hard work, determination and knowledge. It would be safe to say that working as a data architect is no piece of cake. It is a challenging job requiring not just technical expertise but also the ability to multitask and lead teams. But along with all these challenges, the job also offers a great opportunity for personal growth. The learning curve will always be a continuous one and you will continue to grow. As we have already seen, the paychecks of data architects are way bigger than other jobs in the industry. As your work experience continues to grow, your salary will also get higher and higher. In addition to this, an increase in the demand for data architects will also lead to higher salaries in the future. Final thoughts. As technology evolves and time goes by, the amount of data present in the world also keeps on increasing. With this enormous amount of data, the data science industry continues to grow and along with grows the need for data scientists and data architects. Companies need data architects to use data efficiently, harness its power and increase profits. As a data architect, you help the employees in your organization to access and use relevant data whenever they need it. It is a highly rewarding field. If you want to make a career in data science, then IntelliPath has IIT Madras Advanced Data Science and AI Certification Program. This course is of very high quality and cost effective as it is taught by IIT professors and industry experts. So guys, we have come to the end of our session. I hope you all enjoyed it. For any questions that you have related to coding, you can mention it in the comment sections below. So thank you so much for attending this session and meet you in another session.